Hello everyone, it's Sue. Welcome back. Uh, so we're here to do an unboxing today of the November mystery box. I can't believe that we're nearly at the end of the year. So we've got one more for the um, for the year and then we're into 2024. Where has the time gone? So this is um, the collage for November. Um, each box will be a little bit different to what you see here. And these are now available on my website, um, either by subscription, and I do have a few extras left over. So if you wanted to get one, I'll put the details down below where you can actually find them. All right, we'll just get in. Um, so I always do a letter. And some marshmallows and tea, just for you to be able to... Um, have a nice warm beverage and a little bit of a sweet treat while you're unboxing. So I'm just going to pop this to the side a little bit here and we will dive in. So we've got this little um, paper sack with a heart brad here and inside we have the washi tape for this month. Now the washi tapes are all different in all the boxes. So it's a mystery what you get. So we've just got some lovely greenery um, washi tape and some beautiful floral. Uh, the fibre for this month is this, um, it's interesting. <laughs> it's different. I really liked the look of this. So it's a, um, a twine type of twine that's been um, braided with this leaf vine throughout so that would be really lovely on the edge of a page or you could even use that in the top of a tag in your um, nature and botanical journals um, so you get a, a meter of that I love the look of that okay so we've just another little packet with a um, ruffle on the top. Now I'm just going to grab my scissors and just trim that and then this can be used as a um, packet or a pocket in your journals. So it's a sweet little pocket. And We've got all these um, lovely coffee-inspired acetate stickers with florals on them. Books. Aren't they beautiful? Just something different. And I just love coffee and, and um, botanicals, uh, two of my favourite things. So these are really sweet. Those. Another little collaged packet here. And I'll just trim the top as well. And got some beautiful hanging pots and they've got some different they're like a holographic they're gold when you look at them straight on but I don't know whether the lights showing that up that the color changes um, and they're all hanging plants with florals in them I think I've no that's right I'm trying to work out which way to put them <laughs> so it's the same so aren't they pretty? So you get quite a collection of those. I love how they change color in the light. So there's those. This sweet little packet here. We've got a lovely selection of um, different shapes 
bits and pieces um, for all your collages and decorating. So all nature and botanical themed. It's got postage stamps, you've got little, and these are all um, washi stickers. Birds, florals, ferns. Nice selection there. I love these washi stickers, you use them all the time. They just beautifully blend into whatever you're creating. So this month um, I've included this calico bag. So these are really great to reuse as well. Not necessarily in your journal, but to um, store some of your supplies in. And in there I've included a pair of um, tweezers. So we've got this fine point tweez tweezer, which is um, really handy to have. I'm always looking for tweezers and can never find them. Um, and then this, um, I forget what they call them. They're just two different types of tweezers to be able to use to pick up your smaller pieces. Um, sometimes these are really good to try and, if you have these acetate stickers and you have a bit of an issue, <clears throat> excuse me, peeling them back, um, I always use my thumb and peel them back, but you can use your tweezers as well. I have this little um, rose gold spotty bag here. I'm going to try and undo it so that I can reuse it without tearing it. There we go. Here, we have these beautiful printed um, doilies with vintage, vintage documents on the back of that one. It's beautiful greenery. Look at these beautiful birds. A heart. They're stunning. Okay, in here we've got some more acetate stickers. So these are um, some smaller florals. So to get two of each of the florals, they're just beautiful roses. Sorry, I don't know whether you can actually see them properly there. So quite a few of those. And then you get these little sheets here with um, your gold words. You can see that they're, I'm just gonna grab something here. I don't know whether that helps or makes it harder, but gold, gold words on those sheets and they peel off individually. Like that. those and then some beautiful frames and you get two each of those as well beautiful aren't they so that's those So we've got the substrate for this month of these beautiful little um, frames, printed frames that have um, butterflies inside them. So they're just a paper, they're not a sticker. beautiful and I've added another um, substrate in here 
this month um, in one of my coffee dyed, grungy coffee dyed envelopes. And these are um, faux note papers. be fun to use as well and last but not least we have um, an envelope with the stamp for this month and it is this lovely um, botanical um, let me just get here so we've got some little um, inches here and dandelion and some just some sprigs of fern and leaves that type of thing so that's the stamp for this month so that's the november 2023 mystery box nature and botanical mystery box um, i hope you enjoyed that as i said i'll put all the details where you can find them down below um, i do have a few left if you wanted to just get a one-off box um, and we'll see you again for the unboxing of december in a few weeks Take care guys and until next time, I hope you get a little bit of creative time in. See you soon. Bye bye.